My name is Stephen Rooney. I'm a resident of New Orleans. Uh, Painting nature, it's something I really enjoy because for a while I did try to work more out of my imagination and come up with uh, narratives. I, I love the relationships, with the color and the feeling and the, the atmosphere that just occur naturally. So I, I really enjoy just trying to capture what's right in front of me. Um, I like portraits too, but there's just so much life and uh, I mean this landscape in particular. I did study painting. I began at uh, Delaware College of Art and Design, and then I was able to move on to the Maryland Institute College of Art. After that, I moved to New York, and I worked with uh, Henry Finkelstein, and that was a great experience as well. well. This is one of the few preserves, wildlife preserves in Louisiana, which means it's protected. But I just love all the relationships that you can find the animals, um, all of like these cypress trees and the ferns, the cypress knees, they just make a really awesome dynamic. Sometimes I can, I could finish a painting fairly quickly. If I'm in the right state of mind, colors could work and like I'm done, but other times it takes me a little more time. I like them to be a reflection of what's in front of me. And I'll just kind of dive into a painting, which means I just react to what's in front of me. And I, and I react pretty aggressively to one relationship after another when it comes to color placement on the canvas. And I just let it become what it's going to become. So that could be usually letting the color relationships work out pretty well. Or it could be about a feeling, like maybe an, an object gives me a certain feeling, and so I'll exaggerate um, elements of that object. Um, like ferns, maybe they, they have kind of, of, a, of a playful feel, so I will make those angles. I'll raise up the angles and I'll exaggerate them slightly. So with that, I think feeling really comes into play. But you can't achieve that, in my opinion, unless you really understand how color works and how those relationships come together. And then once you have that, then you can then you could expand and really play upon objects and make a more solid painting. You find a way to produce a work. You make it work. And there's many different ways to get to that level. But in the end, it's about how it feels. One quote I've always liked by James Brown, if it sounds good, if it feels good, it must be musical.